I've just started selling merch on Spotify. So at the bottom of my artist profile, there's a link that listeners can use to buy my record. This is thanks to a new partnership between Shopify and Spotify. And in this video, I'll show you how to set this up on your artist profile too. Now in the past, the only way to sell your merch on Spotify was through merchbar.com, a truly awful service. Uh, don't use them, they suck. I wasted six months waiting on them to prove my merch and they just never did. Followed up by email three times. I tweeted at their CEO a few times and the dude just never bothered to reply. So when Spotify announced a partnership with Shopify, I was very happy. Now, really quickly, Spotify and Shopify have very similar names. Spotify is obviously Spotify, but you might not be familiar with Shopify. Basically, it's most commonly used for building online stores, but it's really just a tool for selling any products online. So let's do this. Here we are at Shopify, and we're going to sign up for a free trial. There we go. We've created our Shopify store. Let's begin by adding our product. So let's add a title, write a description, we'll add some product photos, let's set a price, and set the status to active. Awesome. Now let's go to Spotify for artists, and we'll log in, then go to profile and merch, and we'll connect to Shopify. To do this, we need to know our Shopify store address. So let's pop back to Shopify. And this is our store address. So copy that URL and paste it here. Let's confirm and accept the terms. And let's connect to the right artist profile. And sweet, there we go. Now, in order to take orders, we do need to upgrade to a Shopify plan. And Shopify will show you these three plans, but I'm going to show you a much cheaper plan that's kind of hidden. So scroll to the bottom and you'll want to read this closely because it's saying if you remove your online store, you can get access to a $9 Shopify plan. So click remove online store and remove. And now close settings. And this next step is really important. Hit refresh. Once you do, a new plan is now available. It's called Shopify Lite, and it only costs $9 per month. And it's all we need to sell on Spotify. So let's sign up for it. And I'm going to pay for this off screen. Okay, so last step. Go back to Spotify for artists and open merch. And we can see our vinyl record. Click add to shop. And there we go. Now, when we open my profile on Spotify and we scroll to the bottom, we'll see the record. If we click it, it opens our store. That wasn't that hard, right? Now, Spotify only has a partnership with Shopify. Spotify doesn't have a partnership with like Etsy or Squarespace or anybody else. So we need to use Shopify. And that will cost you at least $9 per month or like $6 if you do the annual plan. So you'll probably need to sell some merch in order to make your money back. My work is supported by affiliate commissions, so you can find links to both Shopify and Spotify for artists in the video description. If you sign up to Shopify, I might earn a commission. In any case, I hope you sell a ton of merch uh, and that this video is worth your time. So thanks for watching.